So like just a little update. Um, we had more storms roll through last night. This has fallen down a lot. That's okay. Um, it's about time, as you can see, to be picking more elderberries. I already have a huge bag in the freezer. I have some dehydrating. Is what it is. Been blessed that way. I'm good with that. Um, the yard's way overgrown. Don't want to cut the grass whenever it's 100 degrees. But we have tomatoes growing everywhere. All kinds of blossoms on the beans. I should actually start getting some pretty soon. The velociraptors are out. The vicious little things. What's up, ladies? Hey. Whoops. This tomato plant has gone outrageous. As you can see, it has tons and tons. Oh, look. Here's one that's really getting big. You little bitch. Quit pecking at me. Oh, look, guys. First bean. First bean. Hell yeah. I told you. Um, yeah. Tomatoes. We're not going to be hurting for this year. Oh, shit off this one pound, plant alone. I'm looking at... There's probably 30 tomatoes on this plant all by itself. Um, garden is obviously not doing bad. Look in here. I don't know if y'all can see it, but that's a head of broccoli actually starting to form. Go figure, when I gave up on it. Peppers. Doing good. Almost all of our pepper plants have peppers on them now. We got some, let me see, maybe from the other side. There we go. We got one there. You little bitch. You peck me again, you're going to go flying. <laughs> My chickens have decided to actually be velociraptors today and are pecking me. That's what I thought. But everything's growing good. It is what it is. Look at her. Lady Hawk, you peck me again. It's not going to go well. Just saying. Yeah. You either, Pearl. No. Nah. Y'all act like you're starving, like you don't eat like queens. Please. But yeah, the garden's doing amazing. Thank God. We're blessed. Look at these little vicious bitches following me. Look, only one is smart enough to be back there eating her own food. Oh. Now she's going to be a hater. But, uh, the garden's doing great. Thank, like I said, thank God. We're ble been blessed that way. Uh, just thinking about stuff that's been going on and what we call our crazy world. Y'all look at these berries. Like, they are just hanging. I'm going to be harvesting all these soon. Look at this. It's just so heavy, it can't even stay up. 
That's good. Look at that one. Get those harvested. Oh, stuff's going so crazy in our world today, you guys. People want to be freaking out. And it's easy to because nothing's going our way. But we can control this to an extent. Like, we've had 100 plus degrees. You just got to do what you got to do. Hi, oh, you can't get me out here, you little haters. Look at this. This is in grow bags, guys. Don't tell me you can't grow food. I'm in, this is in the city. My yard is not that big. I promise you. I just make every little bit count. And I can't wait to get down to the country and not have to deal. Oh my God, this is my, this is an apple tree, y'all. Pink lady. This is an apple tree. It is so covered in bean vines. Didn't plan for that to happen, but it is what it is. And it's still holding it up. And this will be on my property someday. So, we have to do what we can do. We can't let all this shit that's going on mess with us. We can't let it deter us from what we got to do. I mean, even in the best of times, sometimes life sucks, right? You just got to do what you can do. Like, seriously, I've always said from one election to the next, my life doesn't change too much, which... I mean, the last year, a couple years have proven that wrong, but uh, I still can only do what I can do. I plant my food, I harvest it, I put it up, I get my supplies in, that's all we can do. If you get too freaked out over what's going on in the world today, you've already lost. Them chickens are crazy. <laughs> so, just keep doing what you're doing. Keep prepping. Keep putting food up, water up. Getting your stuff together. Where there's a will, there's a way, guys. Just keep plugging. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.